Okay, in our game today, it's going to be about sheep because in our story, we're going to talk about shepherds. And what do shepherds take care of? I can hear you. Yes, they take care of sheep. So, I'm going to have Miss Maddie take an end of this. I'm going to take an end of this. You can have even a bigger blanket would be better, okay? And I'm going to put some cotton balls, which look like sheep, right? Do these look like sheep? Fluffy balls? Oh, let me take them. They're kind of stuck together. And we're going to make these sheep go bouncing. The bouncing sheep, okay? Let's see if we can keep them on the blanket. Here we go. Look at those bouncing sheep. Whoa, let's see if we Whoa. can make them go higher. Whoa, Whoa. Ah, they're all on the ground. Now pick them up. Let's try again. Let's see how high we can make these sheep bounce, okay? All right, here we go. Okay, it's better if they're spread out a little bit. There we go. Because sometimes they like to stick together, don't they? Okay, We're, this game is called the bouncing sheep. I wonder why we call it that. Oh yeah, because the sheep are bouncing. Ready, here we go. Ooh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Whoa, whoa, it's like popcorn. Woo! We got one. Whoa, <laughs> that's fun. You can do it as long as you want. Just have fun, okay? Try to get those sheep to stay on that blanket, but I think if you get too wild, they're gonna fall on the floor. It's memory verse time. Here we go. Let's get right into it. As he considered this, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream. Joseph, son of David, the angel said, don't be afraid to take Mary as your wife, for the child within her was conceived by the Holy Spirit. And she will have a son, and you are to name him Jesus, for he will save his people from their sins. Matthew 1, 20 and 21. All right, let's work on the last part, okay? Here we go. And she will have a son, and you are to name him Jesus. Let's do it again. And she will have a son, and you are to name him Jesus. And she will have a son, and you are to name him Jesus. Let's do up to there. As he considered this, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream. Joseph, son of David, the angel said, do not be afraid to take Mary as your wife. For the child within her was conceived by the Holy Spirit. And she will have a son, and you are to name him Jesus. Okay, let's do the last part. For he will save his people from their sin. Matthew 1, 20 and 21. Let's do that again. For he will save his people from their sin. Matthew 1, 20 and 21. Okay, let's do the whole thing. As he considered this, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream. Joseph, son of David, the angel said, do not be afraid to take Mary as your wife, for the child within her was conceived by the Holy Spirit, and she will have a son, and you are to name him Jesus, for he will save his people from their sin. Matthew 1, 20 and 21. Practice at home. Well, in our story today, I'm going to pretend I'm a bunch of shepherds, okay? All right. So, shepherds, what do they take care of? Do they take care of lions, tigers, bears? No, 
they do not. I'm silly. They take care of camels, right? No. Shepherds take care of sheep. Yes, they take care of sheep. And a lot of people didn't think that their job was very important. But God loves the shepherds as much as he loves everybody else. He didn't look down at them, on them like a lot of people did. Well, one day, the shepherds were out just watching their sheep when there was a host of angels. That means a lot of them. And they were singing and they were praising God. And the shepherds were kind of afraid, like, what? What's going? What's going on? Something very special must be going on. They want to see this thing that was happening. So what did they do? They followed, they followed in just the same place where Jesus was born. It was a place called Bethlehem. The shepherds went. And what did they see? It was a true miracle. The Son of God was born. And they named him Jesus. And they came and they worshiped Jesus. They worshiped him. They worshiped him with everything they had. They loved Jesus. They knew that God had sent this special baby boy. Why was this baby more special than any other baby boy? Because this baby boy was God's son. And he came to save people from their sins. Jesus is the most special baby ever. So for this week's craft, we are going to make um, a manger scene. So Jesus was born and he was in the stable. So we're going to make that um, little stable and manger scene. So um, you're going to need some cardstock or construction paper, a big, a big piece. And then um, you're going to need some little pieces of brown like this for the, for the manger part. So what you're going to do is you're going to glue the skinny part, There's two little skinny ones, I'm going to glue kind of at an angle, and like this. These are going to be the legs for the, for the manger. Like that. Okay. And then you're going to glue the other one on top so it looks like Jesus' manger. I think you can Okay, and then I cut um, a bunch of little pieces of yellow, little strips, so that it looks like um, hay. So we're going to put the hay on top of there, so it looks like um, Jesus is sleeping on the hay. Put it all at different angles, so it looks like it's all all over the place. Okay. And then you're going to take um, a little piece like this, kind of shaped like a bean. So this is going to look like the body of Jesus. So we're going to put that right on the hay like this. So I'm going to put some glue on the back of that. Glue it right on top of the hay, and then I cut another tiny little circle to go on top of that. And this is going to be for Jesus's face. So put some glue here. Glue it on to the body part. Looks like he's wrapped in a blanket. And you can put his little eyes. Just sleeping. And now with this craft, you can also add animals because there were animals in the stable. And um, you can even add his mom and dad to 